Stem walls on concrete foundations are popular and make up the spinal cord of one of the five common and basic types of construction footings. Today in this video we're going to talk about the entire mechanism behind how such small walls manage to hold up large structures. Hold on, if you're new to my channel and want such informative videos, do press the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to enjoy latest construction and DIY videos. Our first main question is what is a stem wall or what is stem wall foundation? Well, it's a kind of like type of footing that is typically used in replace to slab at grade or like a crawl step. Here in this foundation, a stem wall is acts like a short supporting wall that forms a connection between the foundation of a structure and the vertical, load-bearing walls of the superstructure that sits atop of the ground. These walls help in transferring the load of the superstructure to the footing, which then distributes the loads over the area of the foundation. Applications. Let's now see why we prefer stem wall foundation or its applications. Stem walls are usually constructed with houses that have crawl spaces and are widely popular in areas such as California, northwestern areas, Texas, and areas to the south of USA. They are also a common preference of the designers and engineers when designing structures in an earthquake-prone area. Houses with full basements, such as the ones popular in Mid-Atlantic, Northeast and the Midwest, or structures built in coastal areas or such structures that are built on piers and piles to raise them above flood levels should avoid the usage of stem walls. If you're into a situation explained above, we never recommend stem wall foundation for your case. Details. Let's now see some details of stem wall materials. Stem walls are usually made from either concrete or masonry blocks. Even though concrete stem walls have a greater strength, which is required in some cases, but they require the installation of bracings, hence increasing the cost and can also require extra visits from the site engineer. In some structures, using preservative treated wood in the construction of stem walls is considered a low-cost solution. If you're interested in knowing the cost of stem wall, here's a brief. The cost of the stem wall depends on the length or the scope or work. Depth of the wall, height of the wall, and the availability of material. Typically, the cost varies between $7,000 to $21,000. Stem wall foundation benefits. There are countless reasons why these walls are popular, and we will discuss the major ones here. Solid. The walls transmit load of the superstructure to the foundation and the foundation then distributes it on its area. Protection to the structure. Since the base of the structure is lifted, the structure is provided protection against natural hazards such as flooding. Access is easily provided. Plumbing, wiring and different mechanical and electrical issues can be easily sorted due to easy access provided by stem wall. Adds to the aesthetics of the structure. The structure gets elevated and looks grander and more appealing. Disadvantages of a stem wall. But just like other foundation systems, stem wall do come with some pitfalls. Here are a few for your reference. 1. They are more labor-intensive requiring high number of labors. 2. Backfilling is required. 3. They are more time-consuming. Stem wall construction procedure. So, if you're like truly interested in having a stem wall for your home, you must know the procedure to get some rough idea about how the things will proceed. Construction of stem walls. There are many ways to construct a stem wall, but all have some initial steps common, and we will now talk about those steps. Step 1 Get the construction site cleared. The construction site must be cleared before the construction of the wall. Any debris, large stumps or plant material must be removed, and it must be checked with the local government if any of the trees in the vicinity are protected. Step 2 Get the underlying soil compacted. The soil must be well compacted and additions, like gravel must be to achieve the required strength. For smaller projects a plate compactor would be sufficient but for larger projects equipment like rollers would be needed. Step 3 Pour the concrete for the foundation. The concrete foundations for the stem wall must be a minimum of 12 inches or 1 foot below the undisturbed strata and the frost line with a minimum width of 12 inches or 1 foot but the exact size of the foundation will vary based on the load of the superstructure, the type of strata underneath, its bearing capacity and compaction. Vertical bars should be used during the construction to ensure that the wall doesn't slide off the foundation, especially in areas that are prone to earthquakes. After the stem wall has been constructed, a sill plate is attached to it with anchor bolts. Stem wall versus monolithic slab foundation. Well, if you're trying to figure out the type of foundation feasible for you home, 
you got two popular options either to have a slab at grade foundation or go with a stem wall. So, why not compare two to make things simple for your decision? Here's how stem wall differs from a monolithic slab. In some of the warmer parts of the states, monolithic slabs are popularly used as an alternative to stem walls, which is essentially a single thick slab poured under the entire area covered by the load-bearing walls. The main advantage that monolithic slabs have over the stem walls is that they are less expensive and less time-consuming to build and since the structures don't have a crawl space, the client doesn't have to worry about maintaining it. The slabs are common in tropical areas, areas where the ground doesn't freeze and, in the USA, they are usually limited to outer structures like sheds or garages. But even in warm climates when the soil isn't compacted properly, these slabs may not be appropriate to install. They also may generate crack along the sections under the structural walls. So, that's all about our today's video. Thanks for watching. If you found this video informative, do hit like and share your thoughts below.